Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cassie if you're new here and welcome to Cassie's Castle. It has been a hot minute since I've sat here and filmed for you guys. I am so excited to be back and after all that traveling and today we have a really exciting video because we are doing a Disney haul because as we know, I took a trip to Disney World and I took another trip to Disneyland. So I may or may not have purchased way too many things, but at least we get a haul out of this. If you do not like haul videos, just exit out the video. You don't have to watch, <laughs> you really don't. We got a big bag of stuff and honestly, I feel like I didn't even do, <laughs> I didn't do as much damage as I really thought I was going to. I'm gonna start off with what I'm wearing. So I did pick up this necklace on my Disney trip. It is so cute, it's so dainty, and it's actually something that I knew I wanted before I even went on the trip. Um, you guys know, if you watch like the purchase or past videos, it was one of the things that I said I was gonna pick up. I'm happy I found it. It has like a little Mickey, super simple, and I honestly have been wearing it like every single day. Next jewelry piece that I got was this ring. And this one is really cute. Um, it's actually, an, it has like a little Mickey, a little bit of rhinestones, and it's like a little chain kind of style ring. I've also been wearing this one every single day. I love Disney jewelry, you guys know this, and I definitely need to do like an updated Disney jewelry collection for you guys, but definitely love these two pieces, super subtle. And honestly, this ring is something that I've been wanting for many many trips and for some reason i just never freaking bought it and we finally did so love it next we have a little plush and this is um kind of like a not a shoulder buddy but they're just like little magnets kind of like cutie cups essentially that you can get like at target but they're like little magnets and I bought him because he is so cute. Like I love the little bow and Eeyore is just adorable. I actually bought him twice. You guys watch the vlogs and you guys know. I lost him after I bought it because it did fall off my bag. So if you are planning on putting it on like a fanny pack or like your park bag, I would secure it with like a hair tie or something because it ended up falling off. Like it's just a magnet, you know? So like, I don't know what happened. I just lost him. So this is my second one <laughs> that I bought on the trip, but he was so cute that I was not gonna leave the park defeated. I need to cut this thing off because why is this so freaking long? Another kind of like plushy thing that I bought is this little Remy keychain. I think he is so, so cute. My first time riding the Ratatouille ride at Epcot. I love the Paris Pavilion. I think it's one of my favorite pavilions at Epcot. I thought he also looked really cute with my outfit and I actually had him hanging on my little bag and he's just cute you know like a little keychain i don't really buy remy merch but i feel like a keychain is like a cute enough <laughs> remy merch <laughs> i have three pairs of ears that i picked up that was not part of the plan but you know here we are picked up these Anna ears and the reason why I really wanted them was because I have the Elsa ears, Elsa ears. And so I felt like I also needed the Anna. I love like character ears, especially if they're like Disney princesses. I always feel like I need <laughs> like every single princess option <laughs> ever. Picked up these Anna ones and they are so cute. You guys, they have like the little rhinestones and I don't know, I love like the bow. So, so cute. Colors themselves aren't personally my favorite. Like, I just don't think I'll be reaching for these a ton. But the collector, Disney princess collector, ear collector in me was like, I need them. And so here we are. And I think they look really cute. Let's do one pair of frozen ears. I had to get another one. I got these because I love that they have pink on them and they also have Olaf. So these came out for the 10 year anniversary of Frozen, which that just sounds wild to me. I can't believe it's been 10 years. That's so crazy. But we have Elsa and we have Anna and it's like embroidered on the side, which is so pretty. I love the sequined bow, pastel blue. We have Olaf with the number 10 in the middle. And then on the back, it's all sequined. Sides, it has little flowers and they're so, so cute. I think these are so cute and I feel like these would be really cute for springtime the summertime um especially just like the colors and once again i'm a crazy collector i'm a big elsa fan i love elsa so i definitely needed them and then plus the pink with the anna like if these were 
pink. I would love them even more, but obviously like it matches her dress, so it's fine. Happy with my little Frozen collection. The last pair of ears I picked up when I was at Disneyland. I originally saw them at Disney World and I was like, ooh, those are kind of cute, but I told myself no. And then I went to Disneyland and I was like, yep, we're gonna buy them. So I got the Princess Leia ears, you guys already know. I'm a fake Star Wars fan. I just like the merch, okay? And it's cute. Like, look at how cute these are. They look like little cinnamon rolls and they're actually really nice quality. Like, they're super thick. It's like a knitted kind of material. We have a leather bow. We have this little thing in the middle. I don't know what that's called. I feel like it's called like the Death Star or something. I don't know. But I feel like they look really good with my hair color too happy with these ears next we have a ton of t-shirts and i did not mean to get this many t-shirts like i really didn't um it just kind of happened unexpectedly i really didn't try to do it everything's wrinkled because it's been sitting in this bag that was like in my suitcase for so long so ignore the wrinkles i'm like trying to like look at how wrinkled it is um the first thing is this shirt which i still haven't even tried on so i don't even know if it fits me but it's a pink Disney World t-shirt. It says Walt Disney World. And I just wanted, you know, at least one shirt that says Disney World. I'm not a big fan of the Disney World logo, but I just felt like, you know, it's pink castle, commemorates my trip, my first time doing all four parts, staying on property. It's a big moment in my life, okay? So I got this t-shirt. I got it in a size extra small. Next t-shirt is actually something that I really wanted um, before going on the trip. And I originally really wanted the Disneyland version, but when I saw it at Disney World and the font was really cute. I need to show you guys text that they used. Like, I love the way this looks. So it's not like the original, like what they use usually for Disney World logos it's way cuter so i was okay with it um and it's from the kids section i got it in a size large and it has the princesses on the front which is so cute and it's a pink tee so we obviously love it i think it's adorable and ariel's in the front in a pink dress like is that not the most perfect thing you've ever seen in your entire life i think it is i picked up this simba and nala like lion king tank top from animal kingdom um i definitely did not need this it was definitely an impulse purchase and i'm trying to be better at that but whatever honestly the next three t-shirts are impulse purchases but <laughs> it has simba and nala and i thought it was cute i like that it had like more of a pink background but i do wish it was like a more of a pastel instead of like a mauve kind of color but this will be cute for the summer you know so it's like okay maybe I don't know next we bought this t-shirt which is another one i didn't need like i bought it because you know it's in the moment i'm just like shopping and buying things and i mean it's cute it's blue it says fantasy land it's adorable it has like a very small logo at the bottom i mean it's cute i just definitely did not need this one like i would be totally okay like if it was pink then i would have been like i absolutely needed it but because it's blue i'm like girl you did not need that like why'd you buy that i just i don't know I, I was in the moment you guys like how can you yell at me for that like you can't you know it's just hard sometimes like i'm gonna sleep in this for sure i probably would never wear this out but to sleep i will a thousand percent wear it to sleep so i mean it's fine i just i, I didn't i didn't need it you know and the next thing that i bought is another impulse buy animal kingdom once again i don't know what it was with animal kingdom they just got me buying things that i didn't need i bought this t-shirt it has a zebra on it like why i don't know but i it said that like a part of the funds goes and helps animals i love the material of it am i gonna keep this probably not i'm probably gonna give this to my boyfriend speaking of my boyfriend he requested that i pick up some hats for him been really into hats lately so here are the ones that we got we got this um army colored hat army green colored hat has mickey has some like distressing very cool we also got him this navy blue just like very simple navy blue little white mickey um cap so cute little hats not for me for the boyfriend along with his new zebra shirt that he doesn't know is his until i give it to him oh i have more jewelry 
I definitely remembered one of these. I did not remember the second necklace. Okay, I got this little castle necklace. It has like pink rhinestones in it, which I think is very pretty. You guys know I love gold jewelry. And it has pink rhinestones. Like, is that not the most perfect thing for me? I think they thought about me when they made this, actually. I think they were like, oh, let's make a, a necklace based off of Cassie's castle and her favorite color, pink. And they got me to buy it. So they're smart, actually, if you really think about it. Um, and then the next time I picked up this necklace and I totally forgot I bought it. Um, it's a Mickey, like a very simple Mickey. Honestly, I'm going to put it on right now. I feel like this is like simple enough to kind of match the rest of my jewelry. Cute. I think it'll be cute layered. Like if I get rid of the other one I'm wearing, but like, isn't that cute? Maybe it's cute. Maybe it's really ugly. I don't know. I have issues. We already know that. The magic band that I lost on my trip sitting in there. Okay. I know I picked up a ring. And I don't know where it is. The very last thing that I have to show you guys for today's haul is my sweatshirt that I bought. Of course, I bought a new sweatshirt. Oh my gosh, I bought two. Hold on. I really did forget all the things that I bought. Like, I went overboard. Unacceptable. Got this sweatshirt, which, you know, I knew I wanted like a classic Disney World sweatshirt to commemorate my trip commemorate my trip that's always my excuse and this is the one that I ended up going with it's just a white one um and it just says Walt Disney World I definitely didn't need it but I wanted to commemorate my trip so once again to commemorate my trip I bought this <laughs> it's comfy I mean it, I needed it essentially I don't I think I brought one sweatshirt for my trip but honestly at Disney World probably same thing for Disneyland like if you're doing an all-day park day I just felt like my sweatshirts were starting to smell by the next day. So I'd never wanted to wear the same sweatshirt twice because I'm like, this smells so bad. Like, I don't know if it's the air. I don't know if it's because I'm sweating walking around, but I was just like, God, like this sweatshirt stinks. Like I cannot wear this. Like after I'm like all showered and like have a fresh clean outfit and then throwing on like a smelly sweatshirt, like I just felt disgusting. So. I know, very extra, very bougie of me, but I just needed a new sweatshirt. So this one came through when I was smelling bad. And then when this one started to smell bad, I bought another one. So then I just never smell bad. This one is an Encanto sweatshirt. And honestly, I wouldn't have purchased this if I was not going with Ingrid. But because me and Bestie Girl went together, we obviously needed to get something to commemorate with our trip to commemorate our trip. I'm just gonna keep saying that throughout this entire video. And so we ended up with Encanto ones, which is perfect because we were Encanto characters for Oogie Boogie, which is another trip that we had so much fun on. So, you know, it's a vibe. It has all of the Encanto family members. And on the back, it says, La Familia es todo. And it's really cute, super cute, super comf. And I honestly really love the pockets of this. Like the pockets were great. They're not like the regular like hoodie pockets. They just kind of like go to the side. That's my haul. I bought way too much stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe for more. I definitely have another sweat set that I ordered from a friend who picked it up for me. So I'm waiting for that to get here and then I will show you guys. Um, oh my gosh, wait, I need to show you guys this keychain. I didn't buy this keychain, but I got it as a gift from a subscriber and I just think it's so cute and she got it at the park so I was like this is perfect and I show it with you guys it's a little C initial and it has a little glass slipper you know C for Cinderella but then C for Cassie and it's so perfect and I think I want to put it on my Stony Clover Cinderella fanny pack I feel like that'd be really cute but okay that's officially the end of this video if you guys enjoyed it make sure you guys give it a thumbs up make sure you guys subscribe for more videos for me I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next one bye guys I thought this video was over. Joke's on you because I found something else that I bought. <laughs> what even happened on this trip? I don't even know. But look at how cute it has the Disney princesses. Like one of those like slap bracelet type of things. You know, so like you can wear it as a bracelet. But like I wouldn't wear it as a bracelet. What I wanted to wear it with is if you have a pair of ears, you can kind of like hook them on 
to your bag. So I'm gonna show you guys this fanny pack. And oh my gosh, I have some ears and I don't wanna wear them on my head anymore. Let's hook them on. Oh, also the bag says Disney princess, love that. Um, so all you do is you grab your ears like this. And look, they will stay all day. So you could have them here. You could have it on like your backpack straps. And it's just so cute. And at least it's a princess one. So it was just an excuse to spend more money. Okay, bye.